The Vital Metrics CDP team is excited to announce that the 2016 methodology has been released. As many of you have noticed, the changes from 2015 are significant. After a comprehensive analysis, I'd like to share with you some of the key differences. The most noticeable change between the 2015 and 2016 methodologies is that there are now four scoring criteria instead of two. While the disclosure criterion is retained for 2016, there are a number of point allocation updates. However, the 2015 performance category has been separated into three distinct and clearly defined scoring criteria, awareness, management, and leadership. Another key change to 2016 is that each of the criteria is tiered and built upon one another. The first category that companies will be scored on is disclosure, followed by awareness, management, and leadership. If three quarters of all available disclosure points are awarded, a company is then eligible to receive awareness points. If three quarters of the available awareness points are awarded, the company becomes eligible to receive management points, and so on. This tiered methodology provides the basis for a more logical scoring scale. The new system also enables companies that have made significant environmental commitments to track their progress. These commitments may include the use of science-based targets or procuring 100% renewable electricity use. The 2015 performance metric was based on a broader score that rated companies on aspects of management, awareness, and leadership, but the specific differences were not as clearly defined or sequential. Drop-down options have been added to allow companies to earn points for steps taken to reduce emissions. This change will raise the bar for recognition of excellence by allocating more points to more proactive environmental actions. Companies setting science-based targets will receive particular recognition. Science-based greenhouse gas emissions targets align with the rate of decarbonization needed to keep average global temperature rise below 2 degrees Celsius, as described by the IPCC. The Science-Based Targets Initiative was formed in 2014 by the United Nations, CDP, World Wildlife Fund, and World Resources Institute. It urges companies to set impactful reduction targets, and since its announcement in December of 2015, over 100 companies have joined their call to action. They provide seven methodologies for companies to calculate science-based targets specific to their industries. The awareness category focuses on how well the reporting company incorporates climate change mitigation into corporate strategies, the strength of emissions targets, and how well employees are involved and incentivized to enact these policies. As the tiered system would imply, this section is closely related to the disclosure criteria. Certain questions may even require that all available disclosure points are achieved before awareness points can be accrued. The 2016 management metric builds off of awareness and rates companies based on the actual actions taken to assess, reduce, or mitigate the negative impacts of company activities. Points will be earned for actions that achieve environmental initiatives, mitigate identified risks, or implement environmental policies that help reduce greenhouse gas emissions. For instance, a higher level of progress towards stated reduction targets can increase the amount of management points earned. Leadership is tightly linked to management criteria and awards companies that have implemented proactive management practices. To note, the verification of at least 70% of both Scope 1 and Scope 2 emissions is required to achieve this A-list status. As a newly accredited CDP service provider, the Vital Metrics team provides a turnkey package to quantify and report your organization's greenhouse gas emissions based on our intimate knowledge of the 2016 CDP scoring methodology. The package covers the quantification of scopes 1, 2, and 3 emissions and formats them for CDP responses. In particular, reporting scope 3 emissions can significantly increase CDP scores. Yet calculating emissions from a company's supply chain can be very complicated, costly, and time-consuming because companies have to work with a multitude of suppliers to acquire the necessary data. 
Other challenges include a lack of familiarity with emissions reporting among suppliers, language barriers, suppliers' confidentiality concerns, and lack of data or tracking ability of suppliers. Biometrics offers expertise in value chain emissions and enables companies to expand their scope through reporting, maximize their CDP score, and gain meaningful supply chain insights in a timely and cost-effective manner. As the one-stop solution to benchmark your CDP disclosure, Vitalmetrics provides greenhouse gas emissions calculations on scopes 1 and 2. Our certified verification partner is intimately familiar with our methodology, therefore enabling an efficient and effective verification process so that our customers are better qualified to receive A-list leadership status. Our team leverages our own proprietary software and best-in-class peer-reviewed CETA database to rapidly create a comprehensive emissions profile formatted for CDP disclosure without requiring an exhaustive list of data from you. We navigate the complicated reporting process to arm you with the ability to improve efficiencies, engage partners in emissions reduction strategies, and become a leader in addressing climate change. To learn more about how Vital Metrics can help you achieve your highest CDP score, identify climate change opportunities and risks in your operations, and become an environmental leader, please contact us at vitalmetrics-cdp.com.